Hey guys, this is Mark. In this video, we will explore the concept of user management and discuss what user management entails, what kind of functionality you should expect from a user management solution. In the most basic terms, user management is a method in which you create, update, delete, essentially manage your users for your system or your application. And in terms of backendless being an application development platform that provides fairly complete user management set of functions, you will see that all user management functionality can be put into one of these four categories. Number one, user registration, essentially the process of creating your users. And there are different ways to do that in backendless. There will be a separate video where you will see and learn everything about creating user accounts. Number two, login. And login is the process of authentication, essentially making sure that the user is who they say they are. And uh, by doing so, user logs in to your application and gets access to the application resources. Now, I mentioned the word access, and access is directly related to the concept of authorization, which is the third element of user management and backhandless. So authorization is essentially a mechanism or a set of rules that you use to grant certain permissions or revoke other permissions to and from user accounts. So they get access exactly to what they supposed to get access. And if they can query a database because they have certain security role, they should be able to do that. And they should not be able to do it if they don't have certain role or permission. So authorization is the third element. And finally, the fourth element, the most encompassing one, it's the whole concept of management. And that includes being able just to see all your user accounts, export them if you need to, modify individual user properties, run searches, uh, control uh, whether a user is enabled or disabled, modify their password, and just like uh, password, you should be able to modify any of the, of the properties. Uh, linking user records to any related data, and that can be done either through the management console or through the API. So all of these functions, uh, are, they go into the category of management. And uh, the, for every single concept that I just mentioned, there's a separate video in this particular course. And uh, I recommend you going through it just to understand completely how to work with user accounts and what user management means in uh, Backendless. Thank you for watching and let's get started learning about user management.